an extraordinary job done by someone like you. Search prison jobs now. That was realistic, wasn't it? Yeah. <laughs> For once. Yeah. <laughs> No, that, 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 was, that was very good. That was very realistic. Yeah. And it was kind of short, sharp as well, like, you know. Yeah, this, straight is, what to, this, is, this is what it's going to yeah. be. This is what you're faced with. Yeah. Those are the different roles that you can be. <laughs> the only thing I thought was, like, um, afterwards when, you know, like, going home and she was still smiling, I thought, is that the reality? <laughs> is that real? <laughs> yeah, exactly. That's you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> so, oh, thank God that's over. <laughs> That, that was just, she was too happy for me. <laughs> the first time I walked the wing, I was terrified. But that was before I spent time here. Because I think it's daunting, isn't it? When you first walk onto a wing, like, and they're all out there, yeah, they're yeah. all by the, do the gates yeah. and stuff. I, I, you know, Until you know, you don't like... know. I remember when I first walked on and you just think, there's, there's 30 lads out there might want to give me a good idea. And in reality, they're not fussed about you. They're yeah. not at that point. They're, you know, they're not bothered. You just feel like you everybody's know. looking at you as well. Mm. I think that's yeah. what... I'd say, yeah. yeah. It's definitely that. We're like teachers, counsellors, peacekeepers, all rolled into one. So for me, obviously, the first time you hear a bell, as your training kicks in, you're walking with purpose towards that bell but your heart's going, yeah. you don't quite know what's around that corner, you don't know what you're going to be presented with, and if you do, are you going to be able to deal with it, are you concerned that you'll make a mistake in front of like your, your peers? I found when I first started that it's a bit like how you present yourself on the day, it's a bit like going on stage. No, but it when is, yeah, yeah, it, it is, is. It's, it's all a performance. It's, it's, it is. But similarly, certainly in our establishment, and I imagine with the, the people, that, the ages that I deal with, that's a performance from them as well. They're probably yeah. like really upset or crying inside. They're missing the family, yeah. but in front of their peers, that big oh, right, sure. yeah, that, yeah, that, that it's not real, and that's yeah. what you have to. That's the breakdown that yeah. we're trying to do. It and and for us, from the chapter perspective, it's being able to read through mm. that language yeah. which they are displaying, yeah, definitely. and being able to get through to the bottom. But I remember my first alarm, just like how you were saying, Steve, it was like heart thumping. But inside, I'm like. Yeah, shaking. <laughs> yeah, but on really the though, outside, I'm, I'm having to completely hold myself together yeah. and think, oh, "This is perfectly normal. This, this, <laughs> this is what I do every day." This is what I do every day. soon become normal, <laughs> won't you? Yeah. When you've done enough, but yeah, yeah. yeah. strange, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. But it's like anything. Once, you know, it's sadly, that you do after you know, respond to alarm bells. But the more you do it, the more you yeah. you do become comfortable with what's coming, and then your level of professionalism and calmness will probably make that situation yes. come yeah. down lower end than, yeah. it, than it need, needs yeah. to be. So. Yeah. And it is, it's about getting to know everyone, isn't it? And yeah. knowing what triggers and knowing who can work with each other. Mm. And exactly you that, just yeah. get to know them. Yeah, you you do, you know. like, you, and you've raised another point as well, <clears throat> the prison language. Yeah. That is one of the first <laughs> things that you need to learn. Yeah. <laughs> yes. You know, I, yeah. I remember years ago someone talking about backy. I don't have a clue what backy was I didn't know. <laughs> I don't know. that makes me sound like a, you know yeah. like, what on earth are you talking about yeah. so just speak to me yeah, just, strange yeah. Yeah, just be straight yeah. and they were like tobacco yeah. like, oh, obviously I'm going back in the days when, uh, when smoking when was smoking allowed yeah. 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 you know they're having conversations yeah. and some of it you don't know some you do and you just pick up little bits that make it out it's, like, it's a yeah. completely different language isn't it, it? Is. it's, it's a, a completely different, different language but one that you do end yeah. up <laughs> learning you come and home and talking speaking. like one yeah, yeah, it's quite cool we go out in the some street stuff like, yeah. what are we doing yeah, yeah, no. <laughs> you have to stop yourself yeah. but it helps it if you've does, got children yeah. yes. and they come out with things hang yeah. on you're not yeah. going to bypass yeah. me and you're the cold mum then aren't you yeah exactly yeah exactly kids know what you're talking about yeah watch what i'm doing yes yeah i'm on the ball there on the ball that's yeah we're like teachers counselors peacekeepers all rolled into one and, and also on this scene like here when you clearly someone's been aggressive yeah yeah if you are not working as a team there yeah, yeah. then you've got you lost no, that. well yeah in fact that, that's a great yeah. one there so we've yeah. got one officer that's talked you know focusing on the one that yeah. seems very aggressive yeah. one telling him you need to just stay there let yeah, them deal with this yeah. you got your two staff there yeah. looking like they're restraining someone in yeah. which is probably that other angle actually yes it is yes, that's true, blue t-shirt yeah. yeah. so they're managing yeah. that room aren't they yeah, <laughs> yeah. and there's a bloke there. i think he's got a pool cue in his hand this is like you just stay oh yeah yeah so they're managing that room very well aren't they given that there's what five officers and yeah. 13 14 yeah 
But if you had one of those officers that are just standing, hovering yeah, at the nothing, side, yeah. <laughs> then yeah. your this this officer's focus is gone. I've, I've got to watch what's happening here yeah, now yeah. instead of just. I mean, you've got to have eyes around you yeah. all times. But if you've got a good team, I know that you've got that dealt with there. Yeah. You're dealing with that yeah. there. Uh, that means I can focus. Yeah. Bring him down. You calm like, him, this guy's going, oh, yeah, yeah. I'm not bothered. And it's also um, teams within teams. So your team will be there defusing yeah. something. Our team, the chaplaincy team, will then come in after come straight down, yeah, and, and sweep just, it up. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, literally yeah, just definitely. check in on everyone yeah. that, you know, the staff are okay because yeah. it's yeah. it's all the emotions that are going on and the adrenaline um, spike and I think yeah, yeah, it's, yeah. Yeah. it's just about, brief, yeah, very much so. Yeah, 100%, yeah. 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 The, our, our chaplaincy team do a fantastic work. For me, being part of a team is just absolutely everything. I think it's a difficult job, right? whether you're in the prison or in the community. It's a really oh, difficult, sure. stressful job, and you need your team around you yeah. when something's gone wrong. And, mm. you know, you're hearing lots of, um, you know, things about p somebody's personal issues, mental health or whatever, and that obviously gets you down as well, yeah. doesn't it? You know, because you, you know, you're human at the end of the day. So yeah. I think... You know, even even that, just going to your colleagues and having a chat with them, and just sort of like you know, sort of offloading. Yeah, yeah. You, you know, it's setting boundaries. Can... Yeah. yeah, but it is, isn't it? It's about setting your own personal boundaries and knowing yeah. what yeah. you are prepared. Yeah. To know, and and for them to understand that yeah. this is where I'm at. If I say no, I mean no. So regardless of what job you have done mm. beforehand, if you decide to come into into the role as you know an officer, yeah, then whatever job you've done before those skills yeah. will, you will find a way yeah. that, that can be transferred 100 yeah, yeah. definitely yeah. there'll be something that you've yeah. done that will make something because yeah. before you do the job you don't know what's happening no. nobody knows what happens inside a prison you get no. there so you'll think to yourself i've got nothing to offer i've got nothing to give mm. but you just don't know what you've got to give because it may be that you worked in customer service for 10 years yeah. it may be that you were uh, volunteered as a samaritan yeah. At yeah. some point in your life, it yeah. may be that you worked at McDonald's when you were younger. She dealing with grief yeah. after grief yeah. after grief. People yeah. giving you, you're being verbally abused. Especially on a Saturday night. Yeah, and, and then yeah. you you rock yeah. up into a prison, and then there's somebody <laughs> yeah. in your face. You go, oh, I've had this hundred times yeah. before. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, the job just changes you. Yeah, mm. changes your yeah. your your perception yeah. of yeah. of your awareness, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Yeah. And yeah. everything's heightened. Yes, but it's also finding that downtime yeah. so that you can switch off. Yeah. Yeah. And I think that's very I important. I think that's where we role. struggle, isn't it? Yeah. If you think about it, it so, certainly a lot of, not a lot of prison staff, but several staff I know can't turn off, and mm. you can burn out very easily if you yeah. don't do a lot of self work. Yes. Yeah. yeah. You know, we've been able to find wherever it yeah. is that's the calming thing for the you. Balance. Yeah. 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 Work life yeah. balance. It, does you your think... job affect you daily? As in locking the doors? Yes. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I'm paranoid I about am too. it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. I lock my front yeah, door. Yeah. I'll go to the car and think, did I lock it? Mm, yeah. And yeah. go back. That's I need, I need, <laughs> yeah, I need to have a sign on, on my LCD, door, it? lock it, prove it. Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah, yeah okay. Yeah. 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 It's funny, isn't it? Yeah. But I say, like, um, you're in Asda and there's assistants mm. and all such shows. You're like, yeah. is that an assistant? I know, I'm, I'm in the shop. <laughs> yeah. So it says it's weird, everything yeah. that, because you've got to be on on everything yeah. within an establishment. You can't turn it off when you go out, can you? So it says it eats the doors, it's the yeah. sitting in a restaurant at the back so you're watching yes. what's going on yeah. instead of just sitting in the yeah. middle and letting things go on about you. Yeah. I don't think, cause you don't, no matter, let's take ourselves out of the prison service now, uh, well, what, what we do yeah. for work. You wouldn't turn off if it was another role, so you certainly yeah. can't turn off yeah. if it's own role, can you? You, you? you might not be in the establishment, but, but the things that make the establishment work, you lock in yeah. and prove and engage, you paying mm. attention to what's going on. Yeah, but when it comes to, yeah, like the lock in and the establishment the, side, and the establishment thing, side, side yeah. yeah. Locking stuff, watching people, yeah. Yeah. sitting in certain positions in a room, so you know, yeah. where's the exit? Yeah, yeah, it's funny. That just, and I don't yeah. know when that happened. I don't know at what point <laughs> in my career I, I be, became aware that where I am, I need to know that's an exit. Yeah, yeah. And those are falling out. That's yeah. where. I did. But uh, did it happen one day? Is it just been over time? Yeah. Weird, isn't it? But now it's, it's yeah. all the time I'll sit in a certain spot. Yeah. yeah. So, what would your friends and family think um, seeing that about your job? Do you want an honest answer? Yeah. I think I'd be even more concerned okay. because it's so realistic. That that is how prison is. It's there are people that are going to have a bad day and mm. be aggressive. There are people that are going to um, have got conflict with someone, and I think they know that I'm not an officer. They know mm. I'm from the chaplaincy perspective. So it's I suppose I'm fortunate enough that I might not necessarily be around when the actual yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. fight is going on. 
but it still yeah it still me coming in and when things are still heightened still heightened as well, and, like, and yeah. being able to help yeah. diffuse that and to calm things down yeah. i think it'll make what it yeah more um real. i think mm. it clearly would open their eyes if if we're if i'm going genuinely that's actually what it looks mm. like because they don't know they, i think that their first thought will probably be what there's a couple of you on a landing with all those people yeah. and they're all angry mm. but then you say well if you look at the rest of the advert they're also telling us the things that we do mm. the things that we're teaching you yeah. probably didn't know that i'll spend a morning helping a lad with these maths you probably yeah. didn't know that the chaplaincy will be coming yeah. down and taking them yeah. off and they'll be going talking yeah. about religion or even just having some time out yeah. and having a coffee so as long as they understand what the advert is trying to say yeah. the realism behind yeah. when there's conflict it's yeah. real conflict yeah. but it isn't but actually we're not fighting 24 yeah. hours a day with the, yeah. with the, with the so, people inside so effectively we're, the positives outweigh the negatives uh, yeah i think so about. pointing out that we wear i think when the prison service uses we wear many hats yeah you're a fireman one minute you're a, you know an officer the next teacher, you're a teacher yeah. and, and, and trusting that that's genuinely what happens i think there's a i think it's a good advert yeah it's good to let society know that this is how it, yeah. this is how it really yeah, yeah, yeah. is so yeah. we get the right yeah. staff yeah. but more so <clears throat> for our friends and family some of them will think it's worse than that and that actually might make them think like i mentioned my daughter thought that yes. we, we we had guns and they wore jumpsuits <laughs> when she sees that it's it's yeah. graphic to an extent but it's certainly yeah. not what a young mind yeah. felt it was so then there'll be adults yeah. that we know that yeah. will think Oh, I bet you've you're drawing your buttons. I mean, we don't even carry buttons in the youth estate. <laughs> nah. And and the reality is that it isn't all there. We might be on there, but you see, uh, you, you saw a young lady there just talking yeah. to a guy that's cle clearly quite angry. He's not grabbing her, he's nah. not going for her. You may respect it. And yeah. then that that open palm, yeah. just, look, just listen to what I'm saying, that yeah. I'm not raising my voice, we're all yeah. nice and calm. What will have come after that that we can't, we haven't got the time to see is the situation resolved. He'll go away, sit down yeah. and reflect. And anything that shows society or family, yeah. friends and family what's real yeah. and what we really do has got to be a positive. Yeah, exactly. Um, genuinely, obviously, I'm aware that I can't, can't say names, but my mother was extremely proud because there's four of us and the other three have all been in prison but without keys. Okay. Oh, okay. There <laughs> so, <we go>. yeah, <laughs> my mum thought it was fantastic that I got about finding my way in without yeah, with being them. escorted yeah. in. <laughs> yes. um, and I think a lot of it, because it's it's a different world within the world, isn't it? If, yeah. unless you've been in an, a prison or establishment, you don't know. So it's question after question after mm. question. What's this? What's that? What's that? Because nobody knows. When we didn't, until we first go in on your first day, we don't, you don't know what's going no. on, do you? Yeah. So for people on the outside, it, it, it absolutely blows it's their minds. Yeah, so, yeah. My mum was proud and everyone else just wanted to know what's this what's that what's it like and <laughs> i do think that you know think they think you're spinning yeah, yeah, yeah. no that, yeah. that's that's what went on it's and that, that goes back to me saying before like you know at first you're really surprised about everything but then after a while nothing surprises yeah, you because been you been just see you've yeah. seen it all before or yeah. you've seen something similar before yeah, yeah. Well, you think you do well you think yeah, and then something else happens yeah gosh what <laughs> you're not gonna believe this, <laughs> this is like... Funny, isn't it? What about your, your family then? My my family, um, you know, I think they were quite surprised because it wasn't something that I'd done before. Yes. Um, I hadn't, you know, even shown an interest in it before. And, you know, I enjoyed working with offenders in an external agency that I was working in before. And, you know, so I was working with probation in, in that sense. Yeah. But um, but yeah, I think they were just quite you know kind of surprised that you know it was it was just a, a, a shift from my previous job. But I wouldn't change it for the world. No, 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 love no, it. no, no. I, I'm a big advocate for it to try to speak, talk many of friends into yeah. to doing it because I know they're capable. Yeah. What about you? My sons think I'm crazy. Do they? <laughs> yeah. They were. What on earth are you doing? Wow. <laughs> and. But over the years, they've they've got to understand that actually I wouldn't want to be working anywhere else. Mm, yeah. I absolutely love my job. I tend when I go home, not to talk about work either. Okay. Yeah. Because Fair of enough. some of the things that we do see. Yeah. Let's be honest about it. It's not all. No, no, no. Positive. Not, yeah. It can be quite gruesome. I wouldn't want them to feel even more apprehensive about mm. the fact I'm working in that environment. I'm about but I but I so. do stress that I feel safe within working with an environment because I'm working with a team of people yeah. that I feel are there to protect yeah. if anything was yeah. to go and there's teamwork again isn't it it's just absolutely everything an extraordinary job done by someone like you
such prison jobs now. So guys, do you think about your job as being extraordinary? Um, no. No? No. I wouldn't say that no, the, the job's extraordinary. Um, it's challenging. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Challenging and rewarding. Yeah. Which I'd like to think would be the same for any mm. job that someone would go for. I think I think what is needed in our job is dedication. Yes. Yeah. That maybe yeah. so maybe people might see us as being extraordinary because we've got mm. that dedication where a lot of people might think, yeah. why are you bothering? Mm. I think it's more it's slightly different to that it's anybody with enough drive mm. and determination wants to do something for that's not totally just for yourself and you want yeah. to impart your skills on yeah. someone can do our job and that's what's extraordinary you know mm. just what you can do yeah. to somebody to else support. that's what and, it is isn't it and and you know you're not going to rehabilitate everybody you're not going to be able to help everybody but if you can support and help one person mm. yeah then that's mm. you know that that's that's win. extraordinary that's extraordinary <laughs> exactly yeah. yeah but i i see it as a you know a vocation a privilege because yeah I, you know it's, yeah. I, hand on heart, I half on, I absolutely love this. I say career actually because there's so yeah, much that we can career, do. I absolutely love it. It's, it's the best thing I've ever done. Granted, I didn't find it till I was middle aged, <laughs> but you, yeah, the, the, it's almost like a cliche that you can make a change mm -hmm. or make a difference. But you actually can, you can because yeah, there's so 100%. many things that we're expected to do and we're trained to do to deal yeah. with that you'll be putting a fire out one minute. Mm -hmm. You'll be picking somebody off the ground that's yeah. in floods of tears because yeah. they've had a visit yeah. cancelled or yeah. talking to somebody that's just been, you know, whether that's assaulted, whether yeah. they've been part of an assaulted, you're actually going in and going, what, what was that? Mm -hmm. Where's that come from? And extraordinary is probably a good word to describe the absolute difference from minute mm. to minute yeah. to minute. Yes. And if you yeah. can go in and yeah. do that, then I suppose that is yeah. an extraordinary yeah. job done by somebody. And also it's about being able to engage mm -hmm. yeah. and have that empathy. Yeah. And understand, and that also that diversity yeah. to be able to understand that everyone's different. Yeah, yeah. everyone's got a different background. Everyone yeah. might come from you know different cultures. All that is yeah. amalgamated into, into one 100%. big. Yeah, you know, and then put in the confines of, of, of four no. fences. Yeah, it's mad and really. yeah. The only thing so I would, I think, the extraordinary bit is being able to break through. Yes, yeah, yeah, uh, and just find that one little golden nugget that's going yeah. to encourage that person. Just be able Absolutely, to. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. The, yeah. where they drawn and I think and anyone can do that. Yeah, yeah are, exactly. That, that, and that's what we need to get in. That, that Sorry, this is no, anyone can do it. But that in itself is extraordinary when you mm. think about it. This this job we're talking about, it's this, 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 and we're giving all of these. Yeah. What's it about? What the role might be, and then we go. But actually, anyone can yeah. do that. Yeah. It almost sounds like you dumb it down, and we're not. Yeah. What we're saying is yeah. understand just what you've got and what you yeah. can give because you might have the key. Yeah. You might be able yeah. to say something or know something or experience yeah. something. And when you are discussing that with an offender, yeah. a young person or a prisoner, that changes well, yeah. what may, may make that young person, for me, not offend again. Mm. Yeah, yeah. yeah.